Now we will teach you how to convert your old tapes like Betacam, Mini TV, DVC Pro, Hi8, VHS, and the like into MPEG-4. This tutorial is meant for the technical people of our company. Let's connect the Betacam to the power. 110 volts. Then, plug in the composite out to the composite in of the DVC Pro. Then, connect the SDI out to convert the composite into SDI and connect to our recorder. Aja recorder. And lastly, connect the Aja recorder SDI out to our monitor SDI in. Now we go to the audio. Connect the Betacam audio out, channel 1, to the DVC Pro, in channel 1. Then let's connect the audio out, channel 2, to the audio in of channel 2. Now we have completed the setup. Now we are ready to convert a Betacam tape into digital video. Now let's turn on the DVC Pro. Okay. Select the input to composite. Select the audio to analog. Now let's turn on the Betacam. Uh, now let's load the Betacam tape. Press rewind. Now let's open the panel. As you can see, the setting should be PPC should be in local. Okay. Then the video is set at preset. You can set it in manual. The chroma is set in preset. Setup is also set in preset and view. When you play the video and you see this one, it means the video head is dirty. So now let's clean the video. To clean the Betacam or DVC Pro or VHS or Betamax, you need to open the top cover of the machine. Okay, how to clean the video head? Get a, get a clean band paper and press the video head then slowly rotate the video head see it's dirty okay one more time yeah see still dirty Then let's place a lighter fluid. This is a lighter fluid. Okay. So after we cleaned it, we'll also try to clean all the other rollers. See, oh, it's dirty. Yeah. 
Okay. Now let's try. And press play. Now we have a good quality color bar. And now we have video. As you can see, it is not full screen because our video source is standard definition and our monitor is full HD. Okay, so now what we will be doing is uh, recording it into MPEG. Now let's insert the SD memory. Now, re now we rewind the tape and press play. Now, once we see the color bar, it's time to press record. Now, let's start recording. We press record. So, we are now converting our TV commercial from standard definition to MPEG to MPEG 4 as you can see the video is not full screen because Betacam is in standard definition while our monitor is in full HD mode then We have audio. Okay. okay, so stop recording. Okay. Then let's pull out then let's pull out the SD memory. And let's check in our computer. Okay, now let's insert our SD memory. Okay. And let's check in our iMac. Subalit sila sabi ko sa inyong mga nakikinig sa akin, mahalin ninyo ang inyong mga kaawa at gawan ng mabuti ang mga nagkukulat okay. sa inyo. So let's ninyo ang sumusumpa sa inyo. Ipanalangin ang mga nag-aapi sa inyo. Ikaw, nag-MX3 ka na ba? Mag-MX3 na araw-araw para MX Extraordinary. Okay, now let's check. Now let's check the properties. Get info. Okay. As you can see, it's already MPEG-4. Okay. It's 720 by 480 because it's in standard mode. H.264 AAC. It's 53 seconds long. Now you know how to convert your old VHS, Betacam, DVC Pro, Betamax tape into MPEG-4. Now we have finished converting a Betacam into MPEG-4, but remember, it's in standard definition mode. Aside from Betacam, you can also convert your VHS, Betamax, DVC Pro, Hi8, Mini DV, 
2 and peg 4. So, we're done with this technical tutorial. This is for Glisa's technical people. Okay?